Hello and welcome to another Moog demo library. In this video, we're going to look at the slew function and explore just a few of its many uses throughout Muse. You can think of slew as a smoothing function. When a voltage moves in any direction, applying slew will slow down its movements. In the earliest modular synthesizers, slew was a critical tool, doing everything from creating envelopes, shaping modulation, and even audio low-pass filtering. Slew is found in the function section of the mod map. Let's take maybe the simplest signal we can think of, the keyboard gate, and apply slew to it. First, let's route the gate to modulate filter 2's cutoff frequency. The keyboard gate immediately opens the filter when we press a key and keeps it open until we let go. By adding slew, we slow down these transitions, making for smoother movement. In this case, the slew amount indicates the amount of time over which any movement is smoothed out. This allows us to take our gate signal and create a very basic envelope out of it. Slew can sometimes be called a lag processor, and its most familiar use in a keyboard synth is in the glide section, where slew is used to smooth transitions from one note to another. The random trig source is a useful feature of Muse, creating a random value every time you press a key. If we turn off slew, we get discrete random steps. Adding slew smooths out these transitions. slew the most for in Muse is applying it to Aftertouch. Let's use Aftertouch to open and close Filter 2. Aftertouch can be quite a sensitive modulation source and we can use slew to smooth it out. I'll go into the mod map and add slew to the modulation routing I just set up. Spend time playing with the slew amount. Dialing it into what works best for your playing style and what works best for the patch and sound that you're using. What other signals on Muse do you want to smooth out? Do you want to apply slew to a square wave LFO, smoothing out the edges to make more of a trapezoidal shape? Maybe you've set up the mod wheel to modulate a bunch of things at once. You can apply slew to one of those routings to have it lag behind the others. The uses of slew are endless and can add lots of nuance and depth to your patches. <laughs> 